to my very first vlog for this course on teen pregnancy. I think it's a very important and very interesting topic uh, of debate as well. Uh, this whole teen pregnancy thing, I think it's, um, it's gotten way out of control. I think that uh, the media has a, had a lot to do with it, obviously, with the whole, you know, Britney Spears, Jamie Lynn, and all these other girls, and, and the glamour that's involved with the teen pregnancy, the babies, and the photoshops and stuff. But anyway, I think that the most important thing here is parenting, you know, parent your kids. Gosh, you know, uh, I think it's incredibly important to talk to your kids from when they're like 10 years old, you know, talk to them about sex, talk to them about protection, you know. Don't wait till they're in high school and, and everybody else is talking to them about what the heck they're supposed to do. It's irritating because as a parent, you should have, you know, the responsibility and you should take on the responsibility of communicating to your kids about sex, STDs, pregnancy, and marriage, and just about everything else. Um, yes, yeah, school has a lot to do with some of the education, but I think kids will take more from it if it comes from their parents, and I think if it, you put that into them at an early age, it's going to definitely um, have a huge gr good impact on your child as a teen. Um, as a parent, you should definitely open up these channels of communication. And, uh, you know, it's important to do this. Uh, there's different ways, like the book has referred to as phatic commun communion. And it's a way of, to open up the communication channels. Uh, you know, you start off as, you know, maybe just casual conversation as when they're kids, so it becomes natural to them, not bring it up suddenly when they're 15 and they're like, hey, mom, what the hell? I don't want to talk about this because they're going to feel uncomfortable. If you open up those channels of communication at an early age, they're going to feel much more comfortable to talk about that, those things. Anyways, um, also is, I, I think, another important thing to do for, you know, your kids is uh, the book uses the term alter cast, and it's to place your child in a certain role. I think that's great. You just assume, and you say, hey, you know, um, you talk about, you know, the, the role of marriage. You know, when you get married and, and you have sex and when you have your kids or whatever, I don't know. I don't have any kids, so I don't know. But, you know, you, you put them in a certain role. You assume they're going to get married. You assume they're not going to have any kids before they get married. So at an early age, they start kind of assimilating that whole concept. I think that's very important. Um, another thing that I think is very important is you, you know, as you're kids are getting older, you're talking about pregnancy and, and safe sex and all this other stuff, or no sex, rather, um, you know, pick an, a, a good location. You don't want to talk about these things just to, uh, you know, make your kids feel uncomfortable in front of different people. So uh, the physical dimension is something that the book talked about. That communication takes place in a certain, you know, certain place or a certain environment. Pick the right environment to talk to your kids, um, especially when they're teenagers, you know, they get all funny about these things. My niece is 14, and she just started high school, and, and she, you know, when I say something, she's like, I don't want to talk about that. Why do you want to talk about that? So it doesn't matter if they tell you they don't want to hear it. I think parents should take on the responsibility. Tell your kids. But it's all in the parenting. It's all how you raise your kids. That's really what matters. And the uh, biggest mistake that parents make is they get scared, they hold back, and when they try to do it, it's too late, or they never try to do it, and it eventually it becomes a problem. Anyhow, that's my take on teen pregnancy.